following is a product of the Functional Cranial Release Institute. This is Dr. John. If you have a difficult health challenge and no one seems to have answers for it, you want to pay particular attention to the following video. Hi, I'm Dr. John Lawrence, and uh, I've treated a lot of patients with FCR for TMJ. Uh, one of the primary reasons that um, I see results with TMJ with, uh, with FCR is that uh, very often the jaw loses its tracking and it stresses out these joints right here that are called the um, temporal mandibular joints. Um, this bone right here which is your mandible is a fixed bone and uh, it's not going to really change shape. But these bo bones through the facial area can change shape. Seeing that all the bones in the skull are separate, and here are the temporal bones, which are the bones that hold the condyle of the mandibular joint, they are movable. And if they are too narrow, again, they will not seed your TMJ joint properly. A real easy test that you can do on yourself is if you put your fingers over your, your jaw and you open your jaw and you feel that your mandibular um, condyles, which are these bumps right here that make up your jaw, if they pop out or if they seem to bulge with an open mouth, that would suggest that this part of your cranium might be too narrow for the jaw to fit. And then that would make you a very good candidate for this type of uh, treatment. FunctionalCranialRelease.com